Elvis Presley's ex-girlfriend, Linda Thompson, is taking a walk down memory lane with some childhood photos of the late Lisa Marie Presley. Linda, who dated the king of rock and roll from 1972 to 1976, posted some Polaroid pics of Lisa Marie when she was a little girl to her Instagram on Wednesday. Writing alongside the photos, Like many of you, I am doing a little bit of spring cleaning and ran across this photo album from back in the day. These are all Polaroids. Time stood still for a few moments as I looked through these precious photos. Little Yisa Marisa, as I remember her so lovingly. She was a precious little girl. Shown here, she was six years old and had just lost her two front teeth. She wanted me to take some pictures of her in my dressing area at the Mana Vale house. After the three missing front teeth photos, Linda posted a fourth shot that shows little Lisa Marie leaning her head on the shoulders of a woman named Dee while lounging on top of a boat in Lake Tahoe in 1973. In the next pic, Lisa Marie is front and center again, posing in pajamas and surrounded by several women in front of a Christmas tree that year. And Linda's caption continued on penning, We had such a wonderful relationship for so many years. She's still a part of my heart. I don't know how many of you are watching or have been watched like I did, Daisy Jones and the Six, starring Lisa's daughter, Riley Keough, but if you haven't, you must. It is fantastic. There are so many nuances in Riley's facial expressions that remind me of her beautiful mom. Lisa's lovely, formidable, powerful presence lives on in her gorgeous and talented daughter. The musician died in January at 54 years old after being rushed to the hospital in cardiac arrest. She is survived by her 77-year-old mother, Priscilla Presley, and her three daughters, 33-year-old Riley and 14-year-old twins, Finley and Harper Lockwood, and her granddaughter. Just days before her death, Lisa Marie was at the 2023 Golden Globes, where she praised Austin Butler for his portrayal of her father in the hit movie Elvis, while chatting with Access Hollywood's Kid Hoover. Hi, everybody. Hello. Tell me what we're wearing tonight. Oh, God. <laughs> You're like me. It's Valentino. Something's Valentino. Valentino. We just had Austin Butler up here. Did you? Oh, what did this movie mean to you and your family? Everything. It just, it's so incredible. I, I, there's no words um, to describe it. It's just so, it's so important, that movie, on so many levels. And I'm so proud of him and Baz, and I'm just here to support them. And Austin was funny talking about, he worked really hard to get Elvis's laugh down. Yeah. And it was a, like a hiccup of the end. Did he nail it? Absolutely, absolutely. Everything, even the, the, the voice, the throat, uh, like, what is it? He, he would make these noises sometimes and he got he got all of it. It yeah. was, you know? I don't know how to describe him, but he all of his mannerisms, he absolutely nailed it. Will you guys stay in touch oh, yeah. from, from sure. this film, whenever oh, it yeah. goes, whenever he goes, whenever yeah. he does next? Do you see big stuff for Austin? I do. I do. Such a sweetheart. And just as good, as Jerry was saying, just as good off screen as he is on. Uh, amazing. Yeah. Such a sweetheart. Like an authentic, true I sweetheart. I was dad's friend. So. Were you guys happy with the whole depiction of everything? What a beautiful story. Absolutely. He likes Absolutely. it because there's a lot of him, about him in the movie. Yeah, Luke Bracey plays me. Oh, nice, yeah. nice. Yeah. Well, enjoy tonight. It's going to be a spectacular night. Nice to meet you.